Hello everybody, I am Tony. Welcome to my channel. If you've never been here before, special welcome to you. Today I have two boxes to open from Betsy. Um, I have their Halloween box, which is this one I'm guessing. And I have another box, which I'm not sure what it is. Um, we shall see. So I cut the tape on them, but I didn't go into them. So, oh, this is their, um, Halloween mystery bag. So let me carefully put that on the floor and we'll open this up. Let's see. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get these bags open with all these nails I got on. Uh, Sometimes nails make things harder, but that's okay. I shall live. Okay. I'm trying to get one of these little trays. Okay. Let's look real quick. Okay. We have a pumpkin, a little skeleton, a hand, a bat. A ghost, a little Jack Skellington looking face. Um, not sure what everything is. Because some of these are really little. That's another bat. And then this one will not flip over. There it is. It's just another little skull. So these are really cute Halloween charms. That will look great on nails. I already have most of them. But I think there might be one or two in there that I don't have. And I might have a lot of this stuff because I'm obsessed with Halloween, especially when it comes to nails and makeup and all that fun stuff. So, yeah. All right. This <clears throat> is some Halloween glitter, which I'm in love with right now. I have a big bag of glitter sitting next to me. So let's see what these are. I got some, let's see. These are ghosts. This is witches. This is lightning bolts. I've never seen those before. Those are pretty cool. Is there anything else in there? Uh, spiders. Okay. This is... I can't tell. Lightning bolts that are gold. And something else. More spiders. Okay. And then we got some skulls, maybe, I think, and something else. It's really hard to see in here. <clears throat> and, of course, they're hard to open, too. Okay, this one has more witches in it, and yeah. Okay, I'm not going to spend all day on this, but let me see if I can guess what's in this one, <clears throat> these are all silver. Oh, it's a mix. Okay, there are bats and pumpkins and a little bit of everything in there, it looks like. We got some red gems for blood nails, of course, which I will never say no to gems when it comes to nails, ever. Um... These are awesome. Like, I don't think I have specific red gems either. Well, I have some, but I don't have a ton of the little round ones. So, um, let's see what this is. Oh, this is like a 20 or 25 millimeter liner brush. This is nice. I like that. Okay, here we got some Fimo Clay pieces. So we'll have to see what these are. It'll be easier to tell what these are, I think. This looks like Jack Skellington. This is little ghosts. This is aliens, pumpkins, um, black cats, and little skulls with a crossbone. Very, very cute. Okay, let's pull everything out of this black bag and see I got a light up necklace isn't that cute <laughs> um I don't know exactly how you open it let's see I don't want to spend forever on this I'll 
maybe do it later. Um, I want to see what's in here though. I got a light purple or pink liner, which it's purple. That's a pretty purple, even for Halloween. Like it's just dark enough to work for that. So I'm happy about that. Um, we got some Halloween foils. So these I'm guessing are all going to be like see-through with something on them. Yeah, they're all pretty much just see-through. And I'm not good with foils most of the time, but the see-through ones I'm okay with. Like this, they're all see-through, which is wonderful. Yeah. Okay, so I'm not going to stay looking at these forever because you guys can't really tell what's what on camera anyway. Um, I am, I have so many Halloween foils. It's crazy. Oh my goodness. These are so cute. These are adorable. There's a black cat, a white cat. There's some ghosts, some pumpkins. I can't tell what the back, there's a witch hat, a gravestone, and then I can't tell what this thing is, but it's cute. There's a pumpkin with a hat on too. Very adorable. Now let's see. The last two are this character. I actually got some of these stickers not too long ago, and somebody told me the name of this character, and I forget what it is already. Why in the world did I forget already? I don't know, but I think the character is creepy and adorable at the same time, which is like my motif, usually creepy, but cute. Um, and these are pretty much the same creepy, but cute. Um, it's definitely got pumpkin vibes and some eyeballs, some skulls, some creepy looking birds haunted houses and a little bit of everything sticker wise. I'm glad to have all that. Now, let me grab this box. I want to kind of know where stuff came from. So I'm going to put it back where it originally was because I want to be able to know what came from where. Okay, there's that. Just need a soap bag for now. I'll put that there. Okay. This is their happy Halloween bag. And I think I might have ordered one thing. I don't know what it is. But there might be one thing in here that didn't belong. Okay. So we have the card. This is Hi Tony. Haunt your nails with our Halloween nail art box. And this tells you everything that's in the box and extras and things like that and then they give you a card where if you collect so many boxes for the year you get um you get uh gel polish boxes and stuff like that i always keep these because just in case i hit six boxes for the year i would love to um get some free gel polish uh they don't have a code on here anymore that is um, just putting in the code. You actually have to do the QR code, which I don't know if it's available on here. But if it is, go ahead and scan it if you want a deal. Um, and then to start off, just as a freebie, they gave me these fall leaf stickers that are too cute. I love them. They're kind of abstract. Oh my god, they put that um, spider web stuff in here. And now I can't get anything out. <laughs> I got a little skull, which is cute. I don't know how I'm going to get all this out. <laughs> Okay, let me try to do this on my lap. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is a mess. Okay, there's spiders in it and all kinds of stuff. I guess I'm just going to have to get everything out. 
one by one and try to get the cotton off of it. <laughs> oh, this is a mess, but it's okay. It's a nice mess. We'll just say that. Okay. There's that. I wish that wouldn't have got messed up. Okay. There's that. I don't know what any of this stuff is. I'm just pulling it all out. We're getting there. Okay. This is hilarious. Check those out. Oh, I got one more thing. Come on. I can actually put this out in the yard if I so chose to, but it always gets stuck in the plants and then I can't freaking get it out. Um, okay, so these are hilarious. I would never wear them or use them because that would mean I couldn't wear nails myself, but these are funny. I think they're funny. I'll put them with my Halloween stuff and maybe somebody will use them someday. Okay, so... This is charms. We have some skulls with bows, some eyeballs with bows. That is so cute. Um, pumpkins. Uh, what are they? Little candy with skulls on it. Uh, ghosts. Ghosts with bows. What is that? Cats with two different eyes. Um... We have skulls with hats on, more spooky little ghosts, some spider webs. The last two are bats and ghosts with bows again. Very, very cute. I want to know what this is. Oh, wow. Too cool. All right. So we got this. And, um, this gem is a um, little holder for your nail stand like it's magnetic it'll stick to it and you can just have this and cure just this at one time I used to have one of these and I lost it I have no idea where it went I love this thing and then I got one from Betsy last year that looked like a ivory pumpkin and I still have that but it's too big to fit that and a nail stand in the lamp but these are awesome and you can use the top of this jar with these uh, magnetic stands so that is so cool all right let's look at these look at this like bag it's a skull that is so cute oh I love Halloween it just makes me so happy like I don't know there aren't a lot of things that warm my heart like Halloween but um I'm, I think I'm gonna keep these little bags because they're just adorable I can't get rid of them um so I'll keep that for now. I have a little thing that's full of red gemstones. And then there's some like gunmetal. Um, what's it called? Not wire, but like chain. And then there's like a butterfly. Plus some red gothic looking charms. Pretty cool stuff. Um definitely be good for a set for Halloween or even just fall or whenever you want if you're me. <laughs> All right, the next skull is giving me pearls with um, some gothic-y looking gems and stuff like charms, not gems, charms. Okay, let me put that down. These bags are so freaking cute. I cannot believe this. They're all bent. That's the only thing I'm upset about, that they're bent. Because I don't know if they'll straighten back out for me. Because I would actually probably hang these on the wall. Because I'm that weird. Okay. 
This is different colors of candy pieces. Awesome. Definitely be perfect for a fall set or for Halloween set. <clears throat> okay, let me try to get the next one open. I'm loving this box. I really don't. Um, this is a whole bunch of little black bats. Too cute. I love them. Can't wait to use them. I know I'm saying that about everything, but like, I really can't. They're so adorable. And like everything that's here is just so cute. Okay. Next up, we have eyes that reflect. I have a lot of eyes. There's some pumpkins in there too. And there's one with a heart, like a person's heart in it. There's another pumpkin. And let's see if I can see the other one. I don't know. These are very cool though. I like them a lot. Um, I don't have anything like the pumpkin and the heart and like the eyeballs I have, but the other ones I don't. There's a bat on one of them. And a haunted house. Too cute. Okay. So let me stick these back there. And then we're going to open these up. This says it is Halloween nail stickers. Which, go figure. Um, I love Halloween nail stickers. I actually have more Halloween nail stickers than I own any other kind of stickers these are so cute oh they're so adorable i wonder if these are the same or if they're different i don't know they look the same but that doesn't mean anything okay i'm literally throwing everything on the floor so I'm going to have a lot to clean up when I'm done. So I got two little pages of Halloween stickers that are bright and fun. These are adorable. I know I keep saying that. Okay, up next, I'm happy to get this, but um, I don't have anything to use with it. This is a nail stamping sheet. I love it. Everything on here is so cute. It says like zombie party and trick or treat, boo. There's little ghosts and skeletons and pumpkins and mummies and everything you can imagine on this tiny little thing. But I don't have anything to stamp with. I thought about con like not contacting Maniology, but making a order. I keep entering their giveaway, but I never win. So, um, I, um, trying to get this out and I'm having trouble. Sorry. I am down for this and I'll use it all year long though. And, um, but I need to get the paints. I have the scrapers and I have the jelly things and all that, but I just don't have the paint. This is adorable and I'm so happy to have it. This is a Halloween nail file that's 100, 180 grit. Ugh. Okay. Oh wow, I got more glitter. I'm so excited. I got so much Halloween glitter, it's crazy. Uh okay. Let's see what's in here. We got we're going to open the box because I might as well. I have a big whole thing of glitter right over here. So I might as well just add it to it. I don't fall. Where did it go? <laughs> oh no, I lost one. I think it fell down in there. Did it? No, but I need that too. Okay, I lost the thing of glitter already, but that's okay. Trust me, I have more. It was white sugar glitter. Um, I have more. It's okay. 
Plus, I'll find it anyway, especially since it's white. It probably just fell on the floor or something. I got, this is a mixture. This is cats and skulls and pumpkins. Yeah. And witches. There's a little bit of everything in there. This one I actually ordered and I have a whole bag of these pumpkins, but that's okay. This is little spiders. Some of the spiders are really big and some of them aren't. Those aren't huge, but they are kind of big. You would need like one of those jelly stamper lights to put it on without like it. Um, I'm trying to look and see if I can find that stupid glitter thing. Oh, wait. I found it and then it fell again. Why me? What is this? I found some bling while I was at it. Oh well. I'm not going to worry about the white glitter right now. Here's a jar of bling I shouldn't even have out that I left there for some reason. This is cool. I have no idea how I'm going to use it. But this looks like almost looks like lace or like um like a weird material and then it has like um foil on it i don't know how in the world i'm gonna use this maybe encapsulate it somehow i don't know but i'm gonna put it back in there i have it in lots of colors and I'll have it all the way through Christmas and Valentine's Day and New Year's and everything else. So that's exciting. Um, next up, we got the good box. Okay. I don't know how to open this without messing it up. Um, this is so cute. Okay. Did I get two of the same colors of gel polish? No, I got Berry Jam and Queen Bee. I think I have Queen Bee, so I'm not going to swatch it. Um, but I don't have Berry Jam. I know that for a fact. I have quite a few of um, their gels. Hema Free, um, Regular, uh, Cat Eye, the Solids, all of them. I don't have black Hema Free Polish. This is in the color Night Dream. It's black, but I always need black polish. It will not go to waste. Um, we're gonna have to see what color this is. I'm excited about this one. Okay. All right. Oh, this is a brown. Um, cat eye. It's really, really pretty. Hopefully, I've been, like, on camera this whole time. I'm pretty sure I have been, but sometimes you end up off and you don't even mean to. Okay, let me get tweezers for these to try to get the plastic off. Maybe. Or... Maybe not. There we go. Okay. Let me get the other one off real quick. And we'll open them both. It is not easy to open plastic stuff like this with nails. And then it sticks to you because of the static. Okay, the one I have in my hand is Berry Jam, which I'm hoping is like a dark purple. I hope. Okay, no, it's not. This is a cool freaking color though. Oh, I love it. See, that's what I mean about, and I might not have Queen Bee. I'm not sure. I really don't know. Um, but this color is freaking 
awesome. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but it's pink. It doesn't, it looks brown on the swatch on the, um, thing. And this is Queen Bee. We'll look and see what this is. Come on. Okay. Oh, come on. Can't ever be easy, you know? Okay. This one is a nice fall brown, which I do think I have this. I'm going to have to look, but I'm not going to swatch it. I'm not going to swatch the black one either because it's black. But I did get swatch sticks out. So, um... I will check out the, uh, the cat eye because the other one, I mean, you can see the color of it. It's pretty basic. I'm not gonna like mess with it too much, but this, we're going to see what it does. And I'm not great with the magnets either, but I try. It's a really pretty color regardless. Like it's a nice fall brownish. Where did it? the thing go? Did it fall? Sometimes these magnets drive me nuts because they fall apart. Okay, let's see. I think I got all the judge away from it. Um, I'm not good at this at all. And I really got to play with them. But let me get the judge back a little bit and I'll throw it in my lamp. That is what the color looks like. It's going to look the same as it dries because I'm not going to mess with it right now. And I feel like I'm dizzy right now. That's not good. Um... So, what did you guys think of the Betsy Halloween box and bag? Um, I thought they were wonderful. And I don't know if it's just me because I love Halloween so much or if it was actually awesome. The um, Halloween box was uh, $49.99 and the mystery bag was $9.99. So, um, I think I got a pretty good deal, but that's just me. Like I said, I have half this stuff already, so it's not like a big surprise or anything. Some of it is a big surprise and it's new and I've never seen it before. And that's the great part of getting these boxes. And then I also get to take anything that I get in them that I already own and put it in a giveaway and then you guys benefit from that. So that is what it looks like dried after a minute. I'm going to get going, but I love you guys. I appreciate each and every one of you, wherever you guys are, whatever time of day it is. I hope you're having a great one and I will talk to you guys very, very soon. All right. Bye guys.